Hello children, today I'll tell you how to work in Scratch online. If you do not have a laptop or a computer to download the Scratch, you can work through your mobiles also on Scratch. Let's see how. First we open Google Chrome on our mobile. So we go to the search place and there you will type Chrome. So this is the Chrome which you get, uh, Google Chrome. So click on it. Now here we are going to type scratch.mit.edu and press enter. So the scratch website will open. Your network connection should be on during this time because it's an online scratch. So scratch website will open. Let's wait. Yes, now we click on start creating. This is the scratch website where you can get many examples also. You can go through all these also. So this scratch start creating that's the button we have to create as uh, click so as soon as we click on start creating button the scratch opens for me where I can work as if I'm working on my laptop so this is the scratch you can see these are the different blocks and I can very well use it so let me make it a little smaller yeah. so this as you see looks exactly like what we see on our laptops so we go here take a new sprite we are going to use that ballerina that we have many many times used in our class also i am going to delete the cat sprite so click on it and press on the recycle bin so it's going to get deleted now this with this ballerina i'm going to make it dance so we go to first we put when green flag clicked okay then looks me jake i am going to put the next costume here now i am going to make it move it so put the move block now when i click on it uh, when i click on the green flag this will only move once so i want it to move for say 10 times i am going to put the repeat block so go to control and this is the repeat block which we have which we have studied also you all are aware of it and we are going to put it like this then we'll see when I click on the green flag what happens. So it moves for 10 times and it stops. Now if I want it to move for uh, forever, I have to remove the repeat block and put the forever block. So I'm going to keep it like this. Remove the repeat block and put the forever block here. Now let's see how it works. We go here, press the green flag and it works and dances forever till we click on the stop button here okay rest of the things i've already explained in the ppt see the code from there and enjoy working online in scratch children now if you want to save your file how do you do that you go to file there is an option save to your computer click on save and it tells me the name of the project you can give the name remove it we give either your name or we can say dance because we have made the dance project so dance and then i click on download so it downloads so at the bottom if you see it is downloading now when i click on open it's going to open the file for me so like that if i want to load from the computer it asks me where it is we go to files and this is the dance file which we clicked so this is my file which gets opened okay so this is how we work on the uh, mobile using the online scratch application enjoy working